This video is for customers who are installing a wood or carbon skin and screen protector on their Pebble Time steel. If you have a matte clear bezel skin, a full clear protector, or a brushed or colored skin, you are watching the wrong video. The only things that you'll need for this install besides your skin is a microfiber cloth or the inside of a t-shirt, a spray bottle full of water, and the plastic packaging that your skin came in, or a plastic card like a Metro or debit card. If you don't have a spray bottle, a small bowl of water will work as well. Pro tip, one drop of dish soap in the water will make the protector slide around a lot easier. Begin by removing the watch band from your Pebble Time steel. The last thing you want to do is to spray the leather with water. Next, turn off your watch by going to Settings, System, then Shut Down. If your watch rings during this install, it will really screw you up. Wipe the surface of the glass and the bezel to make sure that they're completely clean. Completely remove the skin from the paper backing. Begin by lining up one corner of the skin, but be careful not to push down to fully adhere it. Once one corner is lined up, slowly peel up the other sides and line them up as well. Be careful not to stretch the skin. If the skin is slightly overlapping the sides, it's easiest to use your fingers to move the skin by pinching the sides of the skin to move it slightly. Use your fingers to make sure that all sides of the skin are not overlapping the edge of your watch. You can use your thumb to force the skin over to line it up perfectly. Until you fully push the skin into the watch, it will be able to be lifted fairly easily, so don't push it all down until you are confident that the skin is centered. Once you're confident that it's centered, use your fingers to rub the surface of the skin into the watch. Wipe the surface of the screen again to make sure that it's completely clean. Next, you'll need to spray the screen of your Pebble Time steel, the outside of the protector, and the inside of your hands. Peel the protector from the backing and spray the inside of the protector. Once you peel it away, spray the inside of the protector again to make sure that it's wet. Once you lower the protector into the screen area, use the included card while inside of the plastic packaging to squeegee out the water from under the protector. Any small bubbles or marks may take up to 48 hours to go away. Some bubbles may take as long as a week to go away. That's when the protector will be fully hardened. Please be aware, the surface of the protector will feel soft and weird for the first day or two and will attract a lot of smudges. It won't look that great, trust us. But give it a couple days. It will get harder and will look really good. If you completely screwed this up, please send us a contact form. We will be very understanding of goof-ups for the first months of people installing these, so just send us a contact form and we'll help you out. Please contact us and allow us to help you before posting on social media. Thanks for watching.